Alhamdulillah, salatu salam ala Rasulillah. So one of the most vivid illustrations of what taqwa is came from a conversation that happened between Umar ibn Khattab radiallahu anhu and Ubay ibn Ka'ab. Umar ibn Khattab at the time was Amir al-Mu'mineen. Ubay ibn Ka'ab was one of the great scholars of the Ansar. And Umar radiallahu anhu asked him and he said to him, what is taqwa? And so Ubay radiallahu anhu asked him a question. He responded with a question and he said to him, Ya Amir al mumin have you ever walked down a, a path that was filled with thorns? And he said to him, yes. He said, what did you do? He says, shamartu ajtahattu. I, I pulled my garments close to me. They would wear flowing garments. So he didn't want it to get caught in the thorns. He says, I pulled them close to me and I was careful where I stepped. And so Ubay said to him, radiallahu anhu, that is taqwa. And so we learn from this conversation that taqwa is to be careful where you step, that you be pricked by the thorns of life, that you picked by the thorns of shaitan, and that this walk in a thorny path is really just a metaphor for our lives, that you make sure that you, you guard yourself with this taqwa. And so, you know, this was codified in poetry when uh, one of the poets, he says, he says, uh, Taqwa is to leave all sins, the light and the severe, and to act like a person who's walking in a path filled with thorns, cautious and with fear. Don't belittle small sins. From pebbles, mountains appear. We ask Allah Azza wa Jal to make us of the people of Taqwa and to teach us how to be of the muttaqeen.